Hey, once again, it's your boy Day Day for Triple D Gaming coming at you with another how to video. You know how we do it. Let's get to it. All right, ladies and gents, you want this bulldozer in your game or anything else? <laughs> anything else that you cannot get from the mod hub? Uh, that's what we're here for today to show you how to do that. So, that being said, let's get to it. Alright, so first thing we're going to do is we're going to hop out on the desktop and we'll get started. Alright, this is mainly a tutorial on how to install third party mods. Mods that you can, can't can get uh, from inside the mod hub and how to install them in your game. So, um, I recommend using uh, mod network right here. Um, but there's farmsim 22 modsnet I kind of use every now and again. I'll leave the link to this in the description. Or you could do it with um, mods off of the mod hub this way as well. So, first things first, get you in here. Um, so, whenever you open up the mod network, um, <clears throat> it's going to give you a list of different games that they have mods for. Click on FS22. Now right here in the search bar, you can type in anything you would like. Um, then there's categories. Um, but you do not have to worry about uh, viruses or anything with this site. It's legit. Um, you can get a lot of TP mods and stuff off of here. Um, so if you see something you like, you can just go ahead and hit the download button and it downloads it right away. Or... You can click into it, then scroll through the pictures. It always has these ads, but you got that pretty much with anything. Now, at their place for a minute, it comes up with an X. You can exit out of it. But then you can scroll through the pictures, um, read the description, see who it's made by, all that good stuff. But what we're going to do is back out, and we're just going to type in Dozer. But it has all kinds of categories too, guys. So um, it has like excavator, tractors, small tractors, all, all kinds of stuff. So right here is a bulldozer uh, we got. So like I said, you can just click on it here and it'll immediately download it. You'll see it pop down here. But we're going to click into it. Again, you can scroll through the pictures. Okay, read the description. Or what have you. Um, like I said, you can exit out of the ads. This big one playing. Once this line gets over here, then you will be able to exit out of it. But as soon as you like went to the bottom and went to the next uh, page or you backed out, it's going to pop up again. Unfortunately, that's how it works. See right here is the X. Click out of it. But from in here, all you got to do is hit the download button. And right there, it popped up for us. It's downloading. And it's done. Okay. So now, we'll go ahead and exit out of that. Make this bigger. Um... So you're going to go into your downloads, wherever your downloads end up being. All right. Right here is the dozer. Click on it. Open it up. You can see everything in there. Your i3Ds, all that good stuff. <laughs> so all you have to do from here, if you had another window open, you could just uh, grab a hold of it and drag it and drop it into the game. Or right click it. Hit copy. Okay. Now you're going to just find where your game's at. I'm already there, but I'm going to take you through the whole process. Um, so mine's under, I got my game from Steam. It's under Documents, My Games, Form Sim 22, Mods. All you're going to do is just right click on that, hit paste. I already have it there, so it's asking me if I want to replace it. Um, sure, why not? So let's just hit yes. Okay. And for the most part, 
it's that easy, guys. So we'll exit out of that. We'll fire the game back up. And I'll show you. Pretty much just download. Then when you get in here, this is a important step right here, okay? Whenever you get in here, in the game, it's not just, it's not gonna work right away. You're gonna have to find that mod in here, which is right here, and make sure it is, it has a check mark on it. So it is checked. Hit start. I don't know why it's taking so long. It normally doesn't. All right, here we go. Okay. No. All right. Now I'm just gonna cheat some money in here real quick so we can buy it. Ooh, excuse me. Then we are going to hop to the store real quick. Make that purchase. Right here it is. Go ahead and buy that. And it comes with the ripper. Separate. And then we're going to jump over to the store. And there it is. It's that easy, ladies and gents. So, you download it. <clears throat> Recap. You download it from a website. A trusted website. Um, which I will leave the link in the description for the one we just used. So you, you download it, then you copy it and or drag it to your game. So it's under uh, Documents, My Games, Farm Sim 22, and then Mods. And you drop it right into the Mods folder. Then you load in game, then you have to um, make sure the box is checked for it, and you're good to go. So. That's it. Um, this one also has Terraform. It, it's Terraform ready, so you will be able to dig up the, the land with this. If that's something you're interested in. <laughs> but uh, that's it for this one, ladies and gents. I hope it helped you. Uh, if it did, please give it a like. Uh, so if you like what you see, go ahead and hit that like button. If you want to see what's coming, what's next, hit that subscribe button. Mash them notification bells. And I'm out. Deuces.